Lily gets to guide. Oh my gosh. You're flying, Lily. It's a big accomplishment for 14-year-old Lily the pug. She was born with a malformed vertebrae and mobility has been an ongoing challenge, more so now as she gets older. She cannot support herself very well with her friends, even though it is her back legs that have more problems. Very good girl. Lily's condition has been a constant concern for her owner, Anne-Marie Fleming. She has mobility challenges. She had pretty serious back surgery a few years back, and the way she walks, it's, it's obvious. The 100 Mile House resident is the founder of a senior dog assistant products company and feels girl, the current Lily. doggy wheelchair options aren't meeting the needs of thousands of aging pups. They're wonderful for younger dogs, but when a senior dog gets to this point, they're weak in the front and weak in the back. And so we wanted to create a device that really gave them the support they needed to actually keep them moving. That's when a call was made to researchers at the British Columbia Institute of Technology just over a year ago to see if they could help. Multiple prototypes later, this dog mobility device was finalized. What are the types of things when a dog is using a wheelchair that they have challenges with? Where do they get stuck in the house? Um, outdoors, where do they have problems? So the final design that's now being tested and refined by dog quality is this one here. The device is now in the field testing stage in Burnaby with the help of Marley, the French bulldog. It was kind of, it was really neat to watch her kind of help the prototype to become what it is. Um, if we didn't have a live animal to use, um, it would have been quite difficult to get something that would actually work. So we've tried to make it as versatile as possible so that it fits a range of dog sizes, a range of dog ages, and a range of dog mobility challenges. So what we're doing right now is we're trying to get the weight down even further because the lighter we can make the device, the more dogs we can help. The hope is to have the product available to the public later next year. Andrea McPherson, City News.